Alright, so YouTube, this is Mr. Cobra55 with Let's Play Spyro the Dragon! Yay! I know it's been a while since I've uploaded. Um, yeah, I'm sorry about that. It's been a really busy week, but I should be back to doing a pretty regular schedule here. So, in the last episode, I was finishing up getting 100% here, and that's what I will do in this episode. Um, this one I think is going to be fairly short, just simply because I don't have a lot of time. But this is my last busy day for a while. I don't know how to feel about that. Alright, so in this episode I will just go through and uh, look at the last few gems here, which are right over there. And then I will uh, go into Clifftown and get everything there. So the last few gems and peacekeepers are right here, right there. I don't remember where I got that key, I didn't even know I had it. Okay, um, and then just right here, I think, did I miss one back there? Yeah, I must have missed a few right back there. Um... Gotta make sure to keep Sparks healthy. He does not like being sick. I wonder if that was done on purpose. Green being sick, just people are... Never mind. Alright. Crap, I missed that. I don't know... How I ever got through platformers as a kid. I've never been very good at it. Hold on, did I miss one back in that cave? Because if I did, this whole part is getting cut out. And if I didn't, I might just have to restart. Let's see, I did not miss one in here. So where are those last seven gems? I had them earlier, when I went through this level once to make sure I knew where everything was. Oh, crap! I just remembered where they are. Alright, I won't have to restart. This will be quick. Alright, let Sparks get this thing back. I missed him. Um, there's a little... right there. Alright. Sorry about that. I forgot completely about those. But now we will be heading into Clifftown. This is really one of the levels where you want to try out everything. Um, you'll see why once we get in there. These enemies do use metal shields, and then they do have big ones that are not metal. So you don't have any easy to kill enemies here. Alright, so you just run on either side of here and grab your total of four gems. Oh, almost got off the cliff here. Alright, so this is really what I mean by you want to try everything here. Because I know a few people who have always complained about getting 100% here. You just gotta remember to help them cook their chums a little. Every pot in here produces gems when you hit it with your fire breath. If you haven't noticed, your fodder here are dinosaurs. They go from fodder in here to gun-toting Wild West Outlaws in the third one.
How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro. Flame won't harm metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. I don't like the sound of that shug. But it seems to work, so I'll just stick with it. Okay. There's another key right there. Four dragon egg number four. So I found out where he ran to. There he is. Yeah, sometimes they can be just really easy. A lot of the rooftops in this level too have gems. Right there. We can't get to there right now, but we will later. Why am I saying we? You're not playing the game, you're watching the video. Well, maybe you're playing the game while watching the video, but then I guess it would be a week. Although, you'd be looking at this as present tense, and I'd be going past tense. Is that a little weak? It's just like Douglas Adams said, the hardest part of time travel is actually trying to figure out what tense you're in. It's really gonna stump me now. Oh, extra life right there. Back to seven. It feels good. Alright, so you just claim those pots. Run up here. Grab these gems. This guy, her. At least I think that's a her. Can't break that open just yet, but we will again, right in a little bit. Alright, I don't know what happened there. I'm just glad that did not hurt me. those gems, and grab the ones up here, and including the ones that we did not grab on the roof, we're, we're not even close to done with this level. There's still a whole nother secret part, as revealed to you by the sky. Hey, what's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? And why don't you just tell me? But anyway, we do have to fly over there to get the rest of these gems. There's another dragon up there, but we gotta go a long way. Okay, run around, grab that one, that one, kill that guy. I don't know why I killed him, I didn't need the help. Just for fun. Um, kill that guy. point in Cliff Town. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you, I'd use that whirlwind there. And he was not kidding about that. Not every point, but almost every point. Now we have a total of 400 gems here, I think. Yep, 400 gems. We've got every dragon. 
that just leaves a uh, hundred and two gems, which is now just ninety-five. Oh, I thought there was a chest here. So I can open that one. And then we want to go over there and grab all the gems. That one you get to by going up here, and then gliding up from here. Some jumps up there, you can see them sparkling off in the distance. And just go up and grab this one. Now after Spyro, I'm thinking my next Let's Play will be Okami. Which, for the six of you who have played it, you will know what this is. And for everyone else, um, it's an amazing game. It's a Zelda clone for the Wii and PS2. One of my favorites. Um, again, I think I've beaten this one two or three times. So, it's a fun game. You'll see it when I am finished with this one. So we just have to grab a few gems on the roof and we'll be one step closer to getting 100%. That was a fail. right now. So I'm going to stop this video for just a second while I go to the bathroom. Alright, so I am back and I apologize if this seems cut off. Um, so I might have to edit this because Emulator and Camtasia are kind of fighting each other right now, so I'm getting a weird screen. I don't know if that will show up on the video, though. I guess I will find out when I'm done. Alright, so you pretty much go through here and uh, grab these, and this one right there. And you are done with Clifftown. So then just go into the welcome home portal and you will be done with this level. Um, this video actually took a lot longer than I thought it would. I just thought it would be a few minutes, but it turned out to be about 14, which is seems to be the average length of all my videos. Oh, funny thing I forgot to mention. These cacti seem to be moving like sentient beings. Something to think about. Alright, well, see you later.